Hello everybody, my name is Tuba Split, and welcome to uh, unboxing, a haul unboxing. <laughs> Not a big haul. Um, I think maybe by the time this video comes out, I would have already done a video saying I am a huge collector, somewhat, of Lego. Um, obviously, I, I played with them as a kid, I built them. Uh, as a kid and then I grew out of it and then over the last five years or so I've gotten back into them and I've gotten back into them hard in this last year so I got this got this big bad boy right here and I know what's inside I'm just excited <laughs> Obviously, I'm excited to open it up and build these sets. And of course, as always, seems like with all my ready gifts and everything else, is there something else I need to make a video about is ready gifts. Got my trusty, handy dandy Boy Scout knife, even though I was never a Boy Scout. Was I? I don't think so. Oops. Yeah, I don't think I was ever a Boy Scout. I got this on Christmas, like a long time ago. I never became a Boy Scout. I think I finished Cub Scouts at least, but I never jumped the Boy Scouts because oh, this wasn't that interesting to me. I say that. I say that as one of my friends is a Boy Scout. <laughs> Can I get... There we go. I hope I'm not causing the camera to shake too much, and I apologize if I am in post-production. So, right off the bat, and I will open this here for the video. So one thing I did start to do, and I need to check if I'm too dark. Okay, I guess I'm not. Um, one thing I am doing now, okay. Just a little bit of a recap, because again, I'll make a separate video. I did. Not the time right now, I haven't made it, but I will later. That anytime I get a Lego set, whether it's online or in store. I am getting one of these uh, Mr. Grab Bag figures. And the only ones that they had up on lego.com, I think, were just these Looney Tunes ones. So I'm just grabbing them and off to the races we go. So actually, let me go over what I else got. What, what else I got? That's proper English. Um, because then I did sign up to for um, the VIP program because you get exclusive stuff and you build rewards and stuff points. But um, I didn't know like anything about all this stuff. But I started watching um, Potter Mayfig Pals. She is great, great YouTuber. She collects a lot of Legos. That's her whole channel is Legos. And I, I fell into a YouTube rabbit hole, found her channel, because I wanted a review of sets that I did end up buying. So um, thank you to uh, Potter Many Fake Pals for getting me back into it. Holly, that's her name. So there's the receipt. That's not the exciting part. Okay, so here is the big thing I wanted in this box is absolutely huge. So I saw this set. I saw this set on Twitter. I was looking up for Wario 64 for PS5 restock alerts and stuff like that. Um, so I saw this on his Twitter, and I think this set was just about to come out, and I saw there were pre-orders available on Amazon. It was going for 90 almost almost $100. Said, nope. <laughs> That's a big nope from me. And I believe this is going to be my biggest set that I have ever built. And it is the Botanical Collection Bonsai Tree. I... 
I love everything about this. I did try, I did have bonsai trees when I was younger, but they don't last very long, or at least in my experience anyway, it's probably just the way that they were and everything else. And I never found it in store, so I'm like, you know what, this would be a great opportunity to jump onto lego.com and buy this. It is 878 pieces, so again, this is going to be my largest build. I don't really understand how it's so many pieces because the like the stand and everything, the podium that you put the pot on doesn't look like it's a whole lot of pieces. I'm going to be probably very wrong about that. Um, so now I have a bonsai tree, <laughs> kind of. Um, Mixes my fascination with bon my fascination and love with bonsai trees, and um, it's Lego. So, two birds with one stone, obviously. Yeah, because I think otherwise my biggest set. It's uh, Mega Constructs, um, Mega Constructs Gyarados set that I got from Reddit Gifts. That is 350, maybe. I used to have a whole lot, I'll talk about it in the other video, I used to have a ton of Legos when I was younger, um, but I have no idea if any of the sets are complete or anything, so, but again, I'll talk about that in another video, which again, should come out before this one, but I'm just rambling on. So, because I... I'm just wondering why it's in a different language on top of the box anyway um, so again another reason why I, I bought it but then also because I signed up for the VIP program and because it was part of uh, a selection online that you also if you spend more than $40 you get a bonus VIP thing and that is Wow, it's, got, it's a lot smaller than I thought it was. It is a um, McLaren Elva Lego Speed. It's only 86 pieces. I thought it would be a lot bigger, to be perfectly honest with you. It's barely punched through. I mean, I'll take it. I'll I'll build it, but I, it's a lot, um, a lot smaller than I thought it was going to be, just based on the picture that they a company with the order I thought it was gonna be like a good 120 150 piece build similar to a um, sports car like a creator three and one that I have um, but hey if it's big enough to fit a like a, a minifigure in it I'm not gonna complain so that's pretty neat but again 86 pieces kind of bums me out but that's neither here or there so now let's open the Looney Tune figure. So wait, does this have a series? No, it's only those um, Lego ones. The uh, the yellow skin toned, the yellow colored figures that have a uh, series in them. This doesn't. This just has. Oh, I collect all twelve. I'm not collecting all twelve. I just buy a figure every time I buy a set, so. I think we got Speedy Gonzales, just by the headpiece. <laughs> yep. Uh, speedy. Focus. Focusing. It's trying. Come on. Speedy Gonzales. Cool. I'm not big, I don't know a lot about Looney Tunes. Other than just Daffy, Bugs. Well, let me put it this way. I don't know about, like, Lola Bunny. Um, other than... What was the late 2000s Looney Tunes cartoon? Where she was, like, obsessed with Bugs. I can't remember the name of that show, but it doesn't matter. So... I'm gonna speed Gonzales. I'm gonna build him real quick here. I 
of course these little instruction packets gonna be only for those that aren't self-explanatory but I don't know how to build speedy okay so the cheese all the cheese bits are just accessories for him so okay I didn't know Cut, but oh well. Oh, that's really different. I didn't realize this that his tail goes in between the legs. I did not know that. I didn't realize that, I should say. That's kind of cool. I just want to make sure I got his legs going the right way. Or his tail sorry make sure I get his tail going the right way that's a really interesting headpiece though too it's obviously not your traditional head because <sighs> his legs are on backwards of course they are I never thought I'd be putting on Lego feet backwards but I did <laughs> Oh, uh, that's a little embarrassing. Yeah, so then he's got four... You can't even put them, like, in his hands, though. You got, like, four slices of cheese. A little focus. You can't even put them in his hands. Now, a workaround for that would be... A thing that I have for one of my Spider-Man Max. So there we go, there's Speedy Gonzales. He's probably gonna be the only one that I buy unless I find uh, more sets to buy. And then if I find them online or in store, probably gonna be in store, cause I'm honestly, I'm not, I don't think I'm gonna buy very often from Lego online. They're all just gonna be in store, like at Target or Walmart, so. That is the video, <laughs> but Speedy on his little figurine stand and call it a day so that's gonna be it for this video hope you guys enjoyed if you did make sure to drop a like on this video um again i don't anticipate on making probably a whole lot of haul videos unless i really splurge and buy a ton of sets at target or walmart but um yeah i Again, unless it's something I can find little, like literally only online, then that's going to be the exception to the rule. So, again, that's going to be it for the video. Hope you guys enjoyed. I know I already said that. If you did enjoy, make sure to drop a like on this video and stay in tune with more content like this or gaming or Let's Plays and general rambling on that I always seem to do. Make sure to subscribe, hit that bell notification button. Thank you everybody so much for watching. I'll get you guys next time.